For the last 20 years, AKA has been designing and manufacturing some of the most prestigious recording studios in the world. AKA Design introduces the Pro Media, Pro Edit and Pro Wave systems, which are affordable self-assembly desks for mixing, composing, editing and recording. Make your studio as creative as you. Visit akadesign.com. So again, here at the Holden stand, I've got Richard with me this time, who's going to give us a little overview of this little beauty. It's the Panasonic 250. Uh, Richard, HPX tell us about it. HPX 250. Tell us a bit about it. Um, the H the PX250 is a new camcorder for us uh, and a new one for Panasonic, which marries a, a fantastic lens, uh, which gives you the photographic equivalent of 28mm to, to 616mm, um, so very wide to very telephoto, with a, a broadcast quality sensor, a third inch uh, 3MOS sensor, which is similar to, to the one used on the, on the 371 over there. So the combination of this cracking lens plus that sensor gives you wonderful pictures, as you can see from the monitor down here. Um, very good low light performance, very low noise, um, and it marries this to P2 recording. So you can record onto ABC Intra, so a full broadcast quality 100 megabit recording from a, a handheld camcorder. So it's definitely the a first of its kind. So, so the pictures from this are um, considerably better than anything else at the price point and and it will it's bound to be accepted for full broadcast they're being bought by Reuters and and you know and other broadcasters around the world um, because brilliant lens brilliant sensor brilliant recording mechanism what more could you want so is this uh, camera shipping now it is that's right it's it's shipping and list price is four thousand six hundred and sixty pounds um, and for that, you're getting a hell of a lot of camera. Yeah. It's, as I say, broadcast quality, P2 recording, 28, 616 mil lens, and cracking great pictures. But also, a couple of interesting features on the 250 are a GenLock input and a timecode input. If you're synchronizing multiple cameras, that's very useful. It also has something called um, a, a flash band. Uh, it's a sort of flash band electronic filter, which if you're at a press conference, you've got lots of flash guns firing, a lot of CMOS cameras would have trouble with this, but this has an electronic filter to get rid of the problems that mean that every other field in your shot go white. So it's a cracking way of getting rid of uh, problems at press conferences. So I think because of this and the broadcast quality, it's going to be adopted as a journalism camera of choice. Richard, thank you very much. Um, again, uh, the website for Holden's below me. Go there, have a look for uh, information about this camera and a lot of the other cameras that Holden can supply. And again, keep track of us at broadcastshow.com.